it happy. Let's go. Come on. Amen. Amen. Shout a louder hallelujah. hallelujah. Powerful hallelujah. hallelujah. One more time, a louder and loudest hallelujah. Praise the Lord. When the wall of Jericho was to come down, it did not take their prayers. There was no need to fast. It was only one instrument. And the channel. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. The people did not pray for the wall of Jericho to come down. But hear this, hear this. In fact, the wall of Jericho did not come down. The wall of Jericho did not fall down. Why? Lemon. Because when the wall is standing, according to the Bible history, and the the width and the height is the same. And I The height and the width is the same. And I So if the wall falls, it will still remain as the same height as yeah, the no, um, is on, um, um. Praise the Lord. So God saw that prayer of the Israelites cannot do this. Their fasting cannot handle it. All that it is required is what is called Shabak. Shabak emi balono. Wait, we are going to Shabak here tonight. As soon as Shabak was released, Shabak the wall of Jericho sank. It didn't fall. It entered the ground. And the people of Israel walk on it. The meaning of Shabak is Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Tonight, everything that represents the wall of Jericho in your life. Shabak. Shabak. They are going to sink in the name of Jesus. Are you ready for Shabak? Are you ready for three Shabak? Praise the Lord. That means after this three Shabak, you won't need to struggle. You won't need to sweat for your victory to be certain. So do it from your heart. You know why? The atmosphere is thick. This atmosphere is thick of the praise of God. I can feel the presence of God. I can touch it. I can hold it. So when I came in, I've been at the back for more than 40 minutes at a time. I told the protocol officials I want to go into the midst of the praise. I can't wait behind the curtain. Is it that lady, come here, come here, come here. This one. She's, she's my daughter all the way from Addis Ababa. When she's praising, she takes me back to Nigeria. I thought, wait, wait, wait. I thought it's only Nigerians that knows how to pray. But I'm calling Nigerians now. Nigeria alone. That Ethiopia has taken over. Ethiopia took over. Wow. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. Amen. And I was I, I, when I, I came in. And it's Sigaba. When I told them I want to be part of the praise. I can feel the spirit of God. Getting excited. Because I honor him. You know, the Bible says God inhabits in the presence of his people. Psalm 68. You want to locate God? Press. Release press. And it's come down. Now, get what? Guess what? When I came.
He told me, I have changed your message tonight. I'm giving you my message for them. Here, as I was seated, what you are about to hear tonight, it is another unction. That's what went out to confirm whether I hear him well. And he gave me the scriptures which I have not seen before. Just here. That was what I was telling him when I was Tonight, except yeah. That is why you not be a particular. So let's give it to him. Three Shabak. The meaning of Shabak is this. Shabak Malet. The shout that brings about victory. That is the meaning of Shabbat. Shabbat God told them, just give me Shabbat. Shabbat. And the wall will sink. No fasting. No prayer. No struggling. In fact, when they were going around the wall of Jericho, the Jericho people were looking at them. And they said, What is this they are doing? They are walking around. Is it how to fight the battle and win? They were making mockery of them. You are walking around. You think we are cheap like that? They were making mockery of Israelites. But they never knew the God behind them. I don't know who has been mockering you. He's going to church again. He's going for conference again. Tonight, God told me, it's the night of revival. He heard it. He said, on the second day, I will revive them. And on the third day, I will raise them up. So tonight is revival. Getting ready for flight tomorrow. Amen. Today is the second day. It's the second day. He told me in the morning. In my hotel room, I was praying. And he said, Get ready for tonight. You are going to speak. I never knew. I said, But the guest speaker is already around. He said, just get ready. So I brought my clothes out. I put it on the rag. I mean, the, I hang it. I asked them to come and straighten it. You know, I own it for me. Before I came for the morning prayer. And after the service, in the morning. As we got to that back there. God's servant looked at me, Apostle. Pastor David. Pastor David. You are going to share tonight. That's how God speaks. Amen. I say you are spoken to me already. Shabak now. Shabak. One, two, go. And I want you to give you three great hallelujah you have ever shouted. Amen. Now, let's go. One. And hallelujah. Two. Three. Put your hands on mouth together for the Lord and please be seated. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. On behalf of God's servant, Apostle the host of this great meeting, this great event, I'd like to welcome all of us to God's presence tonight. Praise the Lord. Uh, my name is still Pastor David. Mm, uh, that's my surname. You may not know how to pronounce it, that's why Apostle didn't mention yesterday. Uh, all the way from Nigeria. Can I hear any uh, We have our mission, our ministry in Nigeria. We have our churches in Nigeria. Ben Nigeria be then we have our Kuala. missions also in um, Kenya. Be Kenya okay. Kuala. Amen. And Amen. then the mission for nation. Church International is our partner ministry in Ethiopia. I have been in Ethiopia before as a missionary for five years. 
All my children were born in this country except for one. Amen. Uh, but the special grace of God between 95 and 2000, I was in this country. Amen. Maybe some of us are young there. And that is there, uh, where the revolution of 
shall see visions, and also upon the servants and upon the handmaids. In those days will I pour out my spirit. So it's a function of the outpouring of his I mean, spirit. I mean, revival. Revival is the at, I mean, function of the outpouring of the spirit of God. And when the spirit of God is poured, the Bible says he will not be partial anyone. Every one of us we are qualified to the level of your readiness. He said I will pour it upon all flesh. Your sons, your daughters, your maids, no matter your status, you are not disqualified. So tonight I want us to get ready. Because I want to put in your hands one secret that is going to make you to enjoy the outpouring of this spirit. Which is essential for life to encounter his revival. People of God, revival is sweet and is good. It, 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 it has a lot of benefits. That's why you need to uh, connect to the, 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 the speech tonight. In a short while. His spirit will be released upon us and we are going to be caught up with him and our life will never remain the same in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. So tonight, I'll be speaking on what I called by the leading and instruction of the Holy Ghost the secret of his tabernacle. The secret of is tabernacle. Yes, so make this mystery. That word tabernacle does not talk about the size of your church auditorium. You know, at times when we hear about church, they call it something, something tabernacle, church. And what Tabernacle is talking about the glory of God. The secret of his Tabernacle. Now let's open our Bible to the book of Joel. I mean, sorry, the book of Revelation. Quickly, the book of Revelation. In chapter 21 of Revelation, verse 1. The Bible says, And I saw a new heaven and a new earth for the first heaven and the first earth were passed away and there was no mercy raim rafayan qutr and addis samayna na addis midrin ayew fitanya samayna fitanya itu midir alfawallna baharim wedefit yellem and i i john saw the holy city new Jer jerusalem coming down from god out of heaven prepared as a bride adored for her husband and I heard a great voice out of heaven saying, Behold, the tabernacle of God is with men, and he will dwell with them, and they shall be his people, and God himself shall be with them, and be their God. Mm. Verse 4 And God shall wipe away all tears from their eyes, and there shall be no more death, neither sorrow nor crying, neither shall there be any more pain, for the former things are passed away. And Baochin Mulu Kaino Chachoya Bissal, Motem Kangidi Wadi Ihonim, Hazanim Bion Wainim Chohet Wainim, Sik I Kangidi Wadi Ihonim. And he that sat upon the throne said, Behold, I make all things new. And he said unto me, Write, for these words are true and faithful. 
ለእኔም እነዚህ ቃሎች የታመኑና ኡነተኛዎች ናቸውና ጻፍ አለኝ አን ኢሰድ አንቱ ሚን ኢሪስ ዶን አያም አልፋ አን ኦሜጋ ዘ ቢጊኒ አን ዲ ኤንድ ፕሬዝ ዘ ሎርድ አለኝም ተፈጽሟል አልፋና ኦሜጋ መጀመሪያውና መጨረሻው እኔ ነኝ ዘ ሲክሬት ኦፍ ኢስ ታባናኩ ኢየሱ ዲንኳን ሚስተር ኤቭሪ ሪቫይቫ ኢያንዳንዶ ሪቫይቫል answers on the platform of secret discovered mr ochin sitagenyu yemihon neger from generation to generation ketulid is ketulid dress every revival has always happened based on the discover secret iyandandu revival yemihono betegeletu megeletoch mr och meseretno that means ya malet the extent of the secret you can discover ለታገኙ የምትችሉት የሚስጥር መጠን in your journey in the kingdom በመንግስቱ ስትጓዙ as a lot to do with the transformation you will encounter በዚያው መጠን ነው ደግሞ የምትገናኙት ለውጥን for every exploit in the kingdom በመንግስቱ ለምስሩት የትኛውን በዝበዛ the answer is traceable to secret discovered መልሱ ባገ ሁት ሚስተር መሰረተ I've come to share with you tonight people of God ዛሬ ምሽት ላካፍላቸው የመጣው The secret that will make your kingdom adventure tick በመንግስቱ ያላችሁን ጉዞ ታላቅ የሚያደርግ ሚስተር The secret that will make you unstoppable and unbeatable by the devil የማት ቆሙና ዲያብሎስ የማይሸንፋችሁ የሚያረጋችሁ ሚስተር Every generation that discover the secret ሚስተር ያገኘ የትኛውም ትውልድ The end of dog becoming a celebrity በመጨረሻ ታላቅ የሚከበሩ ሆነዋል they leave behind a testimony that generation yet unborn as is sharing ገና ያልተወለደ ትውልድ እንኳን የሚካፈለውን ሚስጥር ምስክር ነጥለው ይሄዳሉ every story you had about the petrarchs in the scriptures በመጻፍ ቅዱስ ስላሉ አባቶች እና በባቹ ታሪክ ሁሉ they were all traceable to the discovered of this secret ሁሉ በመጀመሪያ የሚጀምረው በባገኘው ሚስጥር ነው by the light of heaven በሰማይ ብርሃን ዛሬ you discover the secret mr un sitagenyu the devil will become like ant to you beginning from tonight yabilos kezare mishi jemro inde gundan yihonilachu why lemon the babu says you shall know the truth mazab qidus sinager unetin tawqalachu you know we set you free yemittawqutum unet nata adarachu we are about to discover the tune for our liberty ነጻ የሚያወጣን እውነት ለናውቀው the instrument for our freedom ነጻ የሚያረጋንን መሳሪያ greatness can be made happen ታላቅነት እንዲሆን ማድረግ ይችላል it doesn't matter how you are born እንዴትም ሆናችሁ ብትወለዱ ለውጣ ያመጣ you can make greatness happen ታላቅነት እንዲሆን ማድረግ ትችላላችሁ as a saint of the kingdom በመንግስቱ እንደተላከሰ if you can discover the secret ሚስጥሮችን oh let me share with you tonight ዛሬ ምሽት ላካፍላችሁ that was the secret that enoch discovered enoch ያገኘው ሚስጥር ነው and the babu says ዛብ ቅዱስ ሲናገር he was no more አልተገኘም he played ludo with death moten showedo he did death moten amelata he took flight to heaven katata wode samay berer because he discover the secret misterin silagenya praise the lord siaber imesgen as a praise the lord siaber imesgen alku genesis 5 ze fitrat mrafa and verse 24 kutra ayrat is there the babu says an enoch was no more Henokum altegenyem ilal metsafkudu That is one of the creature that was never buried like Moses Yaltekebere sew nde Musa yasno Nobody no the man mayukum the grave of Moses ye Musa mekaber forever lezel alam Enoch was Enoch never buried like any natural man Nde tera sew gal altekebere Why? Lemon because he discovered a secret Mr in silawoka I'm sharing that secret with you tonight Yani Mr zari akafla The same secret was discovered by Noah Beno yete no yeteredaw mis Genesis 6 verse 8 Ze fitrat 6 And the Bible says no I found the grace before the Lord No begziaber zend mogesin agenya ila You want to find grace Sagan maget felgalacho You need to discover that secret tonight Yanen mister mawqallebat That was the secret that Abraham discovered Abraham yagenyo mister ya no And the Bible says he walked before the Lord is God Mazab qidus sinager begziaber fit tamalalese And he was not put to shame Adaferem ila In fact he believed so much በጣም ከመማኑ የተነሳ በዛ ሚስጥር ታዲያ ባቡ ሰስ ኢት ዋስ ቶን ፎር ሂም ፎር ራይቸስነስ በጣም ቅዱስ ሲናገር ጽቆነ ተቆጠረ ይላል አብርሃም አብርሃም ሃድ ዲ አንደርስታንዲንግ መረዳት ነበር ኦፍ ዘ ሲክሬት ሚስጥርን ተረዳ ኢት ቱክ ኢትስ ኦንሊ ሶን አይዚክ ብቻኛ ልጁን ይሳቅ ነበር ኦፈር አስ ኦፈር ሂም እንደ መስዋዕት አርጎ ሊሰው ቢኮዝ ኢ ኖዝ መክያቱም ያውቃል ዘ ጋድ ዳት ኢስ ሳቭ የሚያገለግለው እግዚአብሔር ኢስ ሞር ዳን ኤቦ ከ ከ ከ መቻል በላይ ዲዩ ኖ ዘ ሲክሬት 
Mr. I'm trying you. to create your appetite tonight. Now listen to me. The generation to generation, they play with this secret and they defeated Satan. Tonight, when that secret is done on you, you can put your hands in your pocket and walk out of Satan with insult. On any issue of your life, when you have the secret, it builds your confidence. It makes you to stand tall. It makes you never to have fear against any challenge and situations. In fact, it makes you untouchable before the Satan. In fact, the Satan, Satan so-called, fear you. That was the secret that Moses discovered. From that fire that was burning and was not consuming the bush. <laughs> when he discovered that secret, his destiny was restored back. The same Moses that left Egypt, ran away from Egypt as a fugitive, asylum. He ran away. When he got the secret, he returned back to Pharaoh's palace and met Pharaoh one on one and put his hands in his pocket and told Pharaoh, this is what the Lord sent to me to tell you. Let my people go that they may serve me. And Pharaoh said, who is your God? That is to say, who is the secret behind your confidence? How can you come back here to so stand before me? Your name was on the wanted list. Hey, hey, hey. You are still being wanted. How dare you that you appear back in the palace beating all protocol. Moses beat all the protocol. Why? When the secret is with you, protocols are defied. I said protocols are defied about your life. The secret, amen. The secret of Mr. Banaku. Moses not go back to Pharaoh as a Moses. <laughs> he went to Moses, to Pharaoh with a tabernacle behind him. And this God told Moses to do somebody to you tonight. You thought you know him before. But you never know him. This is the secret I found. I, my wife gave back to Two children in 13 months. <laughs> uh -huh, uh -huh. I will tell you the details. <laughs> Secret. Mister. That broke barrenness. <laughs> and brought about fruitfulness. <laughs> in an unusual way. <laughs> the story of great men and women. <laughs> is connected <laughs> to this secret. <laughs> I'm trying to your appetite before I open up the secret, amen. But Moses went to Pharaoh with his hand on his loins and commanded Pharaoh to effect the release of Israelites. No apology, no formal address. When you understand the secret, that is how you can command the devil out of your life and territory. Ah, you are begging the devil too much. Some of us have gotten the secret that the bread of our nurseries can fry him. <laughs> Just like I told you yesterday, ask the devil when you meet him. Ask his agent when you meet him. When well, I am sleeping in any Anything house, whether hotel or my house, it doesn't matter any Beteus country I am. Beteus no witch Beteus is permitted. Beteus whether you are here to not hear me, Beteus you are not permitted Beteus to fly on any building where I am inside. Beteus you try it, Beteus you can't cross over. Beteus you will fall on that building and die. Beteus Why? Beteus because we 
are the agent of the secrets that you can play with. When I am sleeping, the bread of my nursery can disarm Satan. You are playing too gentle for Satan. Why? Because you have not discovered the secret. He only feared the people that understood the secret. The devil doesn't fear religious people. No, no, no. no. He doesn't fear you because you are a prayer warrior. No. Ah, your title has nothing to do with him. He can molest bishop. Bishop, he can molest archbishop. Archbishop, he can molest apostle. He can molest prophets. He doesn't care who you are. But no matter who you are, whether you have title or no title, when you have the secrets, you are a commander. You are an instructor. You are a lawgiver. Praise the Lord. <laughs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm bringing you to another realm of kingdom exploits tonight. Amen. You will know the reason why you are in the church. Another spirit of Joshua. The spirit of Caleb. Is what delivers secrets. Praise the Lord. Am I communicating tonight? When you get the secrets, that's another Joshua imagine. Another Caleb imagine. You know why? Twelve of them were sent to go and discover the land God is giving to them. And then says, we were like grasshopper. Why? Lemon. Because they lack understanding of the secrets. Mr. But Joshua Iyasugen. and Caleb, yeah, Caleb, they have the secrets. Mr. And they say we are able. And chill when you have the secrets, Mr. that is how you speak. And that that becomes your language. Don't forget. Atirso. I told you yesterday. The devil and his agent, they are under your feet. You want to know the Bible scripture? Go out and check Genesis there. Chapter 2. God says, after Adam and Eve had that forbidden fruit, and God came back. God said, don't worry. I don't have anything with Adam. I mean, Eve. But Adam, Adam, he had the instruction. You will leave this place. You will go and do some labor work for you to know the difference between privileges and rights. Mm. God now said, as for the woman that the devil used, hear this. The son of the woman that the seed of the woman shall bruise the head <laughs> of that Satan that deceived the woman to deceive the man. Now hear me, hear me. Now. Every time you talk about church, the Bible refers to church as the mother of Jerusalem. So the seed, that woman means the church. God was talking from Genesis that the children of Zion <laughs> they are to be the bruiser you know, of, the of the head of Satan. There is no way the head of somebody will be on your leg. Under your leg. And you will see how power than you. You have not put Satan to where he belongs. That's, That's why, why he affects your finances. He absorbs your health. And is dictating for you. The beginning from tonight. I've come to let you have this understanding. Naturally speaking. There cannot be two captains in a ship. Yeah. There cannot be two captains in your plane. That that plane that fly. Fly. There is only one captain instructor. Every other captain, they are assistants. And until the instructor wants them to talk, nobody talks. Yeah. That's why you can be a captain behind the instructor and never do anything until the plane lands in another destination. No. You know why? Anything that have two heads is a monster.
Repeat, happy, let's go, come on. 